Hi, welcome to Speak Spanish with Maria Fernandez. I'm Maria Fernandez, and this podcast is brought to you by my Spanish learning website, querapido.com. At querapido.com, you can see the free transcript of this lesson. To get it, tap the link in the episode description on your mobile device. Today, we've got a question from Ron, one of my newsletter subscribers. Ron has asked for some common Spanish idioms. So I've looked for five interesting and very common idioms in Spanish. So here they are. Number one, más vale tarde que nunca. Más vale tarde que nunca. Better late than never. This idiom is used very much like in English. So for instance, if you were expecting a parcel to arrive last week and it finally arrives today, you would say, más vale tarde que nunca. Better late than never. Or if someone does something that you needed done a while back and they finally finish it, you would say, Más vale tarde que nunca. Like in English, better late than never. Más vale tarde que nunca. The second idiom I want to give you today is, No vale la pena. It's not worth it or it's not worth fighting for. No vale la pena. Again, it's used very much like in English. For example, we could say, No vale la pena esperarle. It's not worth waiting for him. No vale la pena esperarle. No vale la pena esperarle. Or, for instance, we could say that a movie is not worth watching. La película no vale la pena. La película no vale la pena. Before I continue with this lesson, let me remind you that on YouTube you can listen to every episode of this podcast 48 hours before anywhere else. My YouTube channel is Speak Spanish with Maria. You can see the link in the episode description on your mobile device. The third idiom I want to give you today is Vete a freír espárragos, which means get lost. It's what you would say to someone who's nagging you or bothering you. Get lost. Vete a freír espárragos. It's used, again, very much like in English. Something you would say to a child or your sister or a good friend, not to your boss. Vete a freír espárragos. Get lost. The fourth idiom is es pan comido. Es pan comido. It's a piece of cake. There you'll recognize the word pan, el pan, the bread, and comido from the verb comer, to eat. Es pan comido. It's a piece of cake. So, for instance, you could ask your friend, have you seen the new Spanish lesson? And she would say, sí, es pan comido. It's a piece of cake. And the fifth idiom is, es un cero a la izquierda. Es un cero a la izquierda. He or she is useless or a nobody. There you recognize the words cero, zero, and la izquierda, the left. So, es un cero a la izquierda is literally he or she is a zero to the left, a nobody, someone useless. So, here are some examples. For instance, you could say, el jefe de Ana es un cero a la izquierda. El jefe de Ana es un cero a la izquierda. Ana's boss is useless. El jefe de Ana es un cero a la izquierda. Or you could say, Me siento un cero a la izquierda. I feel like a nobody. Me siento un cero a la izquierda. So, this fifth idiom is, Es un cero a la izquierda. He or she is a nobody or someone useless. So, to recap, here are the five idioms I found for you. Más vale tarde que nunca. Better late than never. Más vale tarde que nunca. No vale la pena. It's not worth it. It's not worth fighting for. No vale la pena. Vete a freír espárragos. Get lost. Vete a freír espárragos. Es pan comido. It's a piece of cake. Es pan comido. 
hand es un cero a la izquierda. He or she is a nobody or useless. Es un cero a la izquierda. There are of course many more Spanish idioms. Just like in English, idioms reflect all our emotions and feelings. Funny, motivating, ironic, inspirational, sarcastic, thought-provoking, they can reflect all human emotions. So learning the Spanish idioms will give a great boost to the way you can express your feelings in Spanish, the way you can communicate with other people, the way you can make friends or have deeper connections with native speakers. The easiest way to learn Spanish idioms is in context. Learning a list of idioms can be useful, like here, for example, when I've given you five and I've gone through them. But usually the best way to, to learn idioms is in context, within a dialogue or an oration text. Let's recap once more the five expressions that I've given you in this episode. Más vale tarde que nunca. Better late than never. Más vale tarde que nunca. No vale la pena. It's not worth it. It's not worth fighting for. No vale la pena. Vete a freír espárragos. Get lost. Vete a freír espárragos. Es pan comido. It's a piece of cake. Es pan comido. Es un cero a la izquierda. He or she is useless or a nobody. Es un cero a la izquierda. To help you learn the Spanish idioms fast, I've created a step-by-step Spanish speaking course. To find out more about it, go to kerapido.com forward slash speaking or simply tap the link in the episode description on your mobile device.